Yeah, just seeing you take a hot lap in that. Oh, my goodness. Well, Andrew may not be hitting the road, but local veterans are. They're on the road to healing, and they're putting on helmets and hopping on two wheels to get there. Our Ty Lisa Hampton joins us now. Ty Lisa, motorcycles are actually a therapy tool for these vets. Yeah, Laura, the veterans I spoke with say there's nothing quite like being on a motorcycle and having some control of their surroundings. But more importantly, they all agree no matter what traumas they're battling with, their bikes give them comfort through the difficult times. As the engine roars to life and he sets his sights on the road, Army veteran Sandy Preacher Spengler is on a mission. I was in Vietnam in 70 and 71. To put all that behind him. It, it really has helped me to think through some of the things that, uh, that have been difficult to process, even 50 years after being in the military. Spengler says he and other veterans ride as therapy to deal with trauma. If you served if you served in the military, then it's kind of like a brotherhood. Uh, riding motorcycles is similar. To Leaning on each other on and off their bikes. Air Force veteran Brian Smokey Wall believes it's crucial to help overcome traumatic experiences. But I think all of us that have served, especially in combat, deal with it in some form or fashion. For Army veteran Joseph Little, working with and getting on a motorcycle gives him a sense of calm. Uh, which is a relief from some of the things that are going on in, inside my head. So the freedom is the biggest thing. They all want to help fellow veterans, and it doesn't have to be on a bike. Or otherwise, if they're having issues, PTSD, mental issues, whatever, there's been a long-standing stigma of it's a sign of weakness to ask for help. And a lot of people have worked really hard to try to squash that mentality because it really isn't a sign of weakness, it's a sign of strength. Well, if you are someone you know is a veteran and is struggling with trauma or PTSD, you can call the Arkansas Department of Veteran Affairs at 501-683-2382. And if you yourself are a veteran and would like to know more about how you can get involved in veteran motorcycle organizations, you can go to kark.com. Back to you.